a word about symmetry. Symmetry is not actually always normal. All right. <sighs> okay. Like that case that we saw with global ischemia, mm -hmm. where there's just diffuse loss of gray white differentiation, it's going to be symmetric but not normal. Okay. Um, you know, looking at things like um, hydrocephalus. Yeah. All right. Those ventricles are symmetric. Yeah. But not normal. Yeah. And then the case on the right, um, if you look in the front, these are actually chronic subdurals. Oh, wow. It's okay. not CSF density. They're sort of mass occupying. Those are, are bilateral chronic. I could totally see myself passing by those mm -hmm. on first glance Yeah, because of the symmetry. And again, it's not always our friend. Mm -hmm. All right, so just sort of keep that in mind as you go through. Absolutely. Um, so we've gone up on our quick pass up, our A pass. Okay. But it doesn't look that bad, no. right? And so as I'm looking at this, you know, I'm looking at the mastoid air, air cells. They're a little bit asymmetric. Mm -hmm. I'm seeing more what looks like bone density here yeah. compared to the other side. But I'm like, they're rotated, so that's probably just yeah. that. Um, until you adjust the contrast on it. Uh -oh. And when you do that, you see this hyperdensity hiding right here mm -hmm. up against the bone. And that's actually an epidural hematoma. That's a temporal epidural. Oh, geez. 